News right now, Shelby County Mayor Lee Harris tells ABC 24 he had no knowledge of the state's findings about shoddy budget keeping outlined in a warning letter yesterday from the state comptroller's office. Thanks for joining us. I'm Richard Ransom. And I'm Pepper Baker. The letter was unveiled at a Shelby County Commissioner's meeting where everyone learned the county may lose out on millions of dollars if next year's fiscal budget is not submitted correctly. Again, Mayor Harris says this all came as a surprise to him. ABC 24's Stefan Reels has followed this story since we broke it yesterday. Uh, Stefan, you caught up with Mayor Harris today. Did the mayor explain why he knew nothing about it? Well, Richard, according to the state comptroller's office, both Harris's office and Shelby County commissioners received the same letter in an email two weeks ago on September 25th. And in it, the office went into the issues within the county, and this really went against what Harris says he believed about the administration and finance department up until now. We have been commended by lots of state actors, and so I'm surprised by this latest revelation. New reaction from Shelby County Mayor Lee Harris after Wednesday's shocking revelation that the county could be barred from borrowing money unless its 2026 budget is submitted correctly. After this email to Harris's office and the county commissioners show four years of incomplete submissions. Many letters in the past saying that everything is going swimmingly in Memphis and Shelby County. So I can't wait to see what this new thing is. I hadn't heard it or received any letters yet. So I'm going to have to wait and see. In an email, a spokesperson with the Tennessee Comptroller's office said only three people from Shelby County responded to the office following the email. Commissioners Edmund Ford Jr. and Amber Mills and Michael Thompson from the county's administration and finance department. Thompson himself defended the county's ability to still get a budget approved year after year in Wednesday's committee meeting. A lot of times at the last minute, the administration was getting the budget down to us and we having to make changes right before the deadline uh, makes it hard on everybody. According to Shelby County Commissioner Charlie Caswell, the budget process is planned to move up three months, which should give the county more than enough time to make sure every document in the budget is submitted. What do you want to say to the people who are concerned? I, I feel there shouldn't be any concern because I feel that the administration and the commission understand the seriousness of this matter and we're moving steps ahead to get make sure that it's done correctly. And Richard Pepper, right now the budget process is expected to start in December, which is about three months earlier than usual. And we should get a clear idea of what this is going to look like in November or at the tail end of this month.